Sunny in Zablistai. That is how we say arise and shine back in Bosnia. And truly, we shall arise and shine for the light has come and the glory of the Lord has risen upon us. Welcome to our Austrian announcements, today being the 17th of November 2024, which is still the year of threshing mountains. I will be your host for today, the one, the only, Joy Kara. KZ, the church of choice, we have pastors who are ready to serve us all. If you'd like to reach out to any of them, the pastors this week are Pastor David Kibera, Pastor Brian Washigadi, and Reverend Millicent Kaunda, whose numbers are on the screen. At DCIKZ, we care for you. To all the parents who would like for their children to be dedicated, this announcement is specially crafted for you. There will be a child dedication happening on the 1st of December 2024 right here at DCIKZ main campus in both our services. However, there is a parents briefing that will happen on the 24th of November 2024 right here at DCIKZ main campus from 1 p.m. Parents are encouraged to pick a registration form from any of our ushers and return it as they come for the briefing. You are welcome. And he said to them, go into all the world and preach the gospel to everyone. That is in the book of Mark chapter 16 and verse 15. On that note, our evangelism days are every Monday, Wednesday and Saturday. Please note that you can take all the three days or you can pick either of the days. To be part of the team, you can contact Pastor Alex Charago through the numbers on the screen. Also note that we meet at the cathedral at 1 p.m. for prayer and teaming. And just as Peter was empowered by the Holy Spirit to proclaim of Jesus, may we also receive the same power to talk of Jesus and preach Jesus to everyone that we come across. To all the ladies in the house, the long-awaited day is finally here with us. The Daughters of Impact to Semezane November edition is taking place today at the main campus starting to PM. And the topic of the day is navigating my hidden treasures with none other than our very own Professor Elizabeth Kuria. To all the ladies, let's keep time 2 p.m. Usi Telewe Karibuni Sana. family we have a reason to celebrate we have a reason to rejoice do you know that we are approximately 45 days till the end of the year with that said we would like to invite you to the end of year revival that will happen from monday all through to wednesday the 25th all through to the 27th of november 2024 right here at dci from 6 p.m all through to 8 p.m i'm talking about the call of god that will identify who you are and shift your DNA, connect you with the heaven, pour the spirit upon your life, make you a special tool in the hands of God, change your future and change your life. That's what happened to Moses. The speaker will be none other than Apostle Juma. Come, let's tarry in the presence of the Lord together. These men, they made blunders. Moses, for instance, killed a man in trying to save Israel from Egypt. The previous generation that has brought us at the verge of Jordan to a place where we can cross over. We acknowledge they made blunders. They made mistakes. They were weak. They were other vessels, but they carried heavenly treasure. Even you, you are being disrupted by your weaknesses, by your challenges, by your failures. But God likes to use failures that he can show forth his glory. In case you are messed up, God will clean you up this weekend.
We are pleased to announce the wedding between our sister Evelyn Kanini Mwendwa and our brother Simon Gidheri Nganga. The wedding will take place on Saturday 30th of November 2024 at Deliverance Church Zimmerman from 10 a.m. If you have any valid reason why these two should not be joined in holy matrimony, speak now or forever hold your peace. We are pleased to announce the wedding between our brother Martin Karioki Njuki and our sister Jacqueline Jambi Gosho. The wedding will take place on the 7th of December 2024 at DCIKZ main campus from 10.30 a.m. and the reception thereafter at Kenya Institute of Survey and Mapping Grounds. If anyone has a valid reason why these two should not be joined in holy matrimony, please speak now or forever hold your peace. Chances are that you have access to social media. Chances are that your neighbor has access to social media. Chances are that you most probably haven't followed us on our social media platforms that is on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, and on YouTube, where you will find daily encouragement, summons, or any updates. Probably you like to listen in while on the go. Visit our podcast that is on Spotify and on Podbean. Pictures and videos that have been taken during our services are usually posted on our social media platforms. If for whatever reason you're not comfortable with us posting you, kindly reach out to the numbers on your screens and we shall be ready to oblige. At DCIKZ, we are social. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God, be still and know that I am God. Just an encouragement for us all as we step into a new week. Remember that God will fight your battles for you as long as you remain still in Him. That brings us to the end of our on-screen announcements. I have been your host, the one, the only, Joy Kara. Until we meet again, bye-bye. We are used to finding faults wherever things have not worked. The Bible is trying to convince us today, let us not always find fault. Why is it important for us to give thanks even where we are at a difficulty? Giving thanks at that time when things are not working it shows that you have lifted God above the situation. It shows that you know that God can fix it. And therefore, you are giving thanks. When we give thanks at that time, God looked at you from heaven. You normally touch the heart of God. Wherever you give thanks, when you are in the hard time, God looked at you from heaven and said, this is my son. This is my daughter. He has full trust in me. And at that particular time, when God is pleased because of your gratitude, the hand of God moves and it changes your life around during that Thanksgiving.